In this video, we will show you how to connect the premium BYD battery box to the Coastal Plenticore Plus or Plenticore BI. Please note the information relating to proper use. To operate a battery system, please first install the Coastal Smart Energy Meter. If you wish to connect the battery to a Plenticore Plus, you will also need an appropriate activation code. You can get this code from the online Coastal Solar Electric Shop. Please also watch the training videos about the Plenticore and Coastal Smart Energy Meter in preparation. During installation, you will need protective earthing conductor cable with cable shoe to fit, a network cable for communication connection between Plenticore and battery, a PV cable for the DC connection, and a pair of SunClix plugs for the Plenticore accessories, as well as a network cable, optional for connecting the battery to the internet. Before getting started, switch off any components in your PV system that may already be running. Please install the battery system as outlined in the enclosed installation instructions. Note that the length of the cables between the battery and the Plenticore must not exceed 15 meters. First align the base plate and position the individual battery modules in relation to one another. Finish with the management module, BCU. Screw the modules firmly to one another and the wall. Now guide the connection cables through the cable glands provided on the terminal compartment cover of the management module. Start by connecting the PE connection of the battery to the equipotential bonding bus bar. Note, it is absolutely essential that this connection is made. There must be no potential difference between the PE connection of the Plenticore and the battery. Be particularly careful to ensure that all cables are installed and routed in an EMC-appropriate manner. Now connect the communication cable to the Plenticore at the terminal block connector. Alternatively, you can also use the RJ45 socket. Connect the other end of the cable to the X601 terminal of the Plenticore. Note, we recommend a network cable of Category 5E or higher. Please ensure that the three dip switches for the terminating resistors are in the on position, on left. Connect your battery system to the internet. When you do this, the system transmits its operating data to the manufacturer so that support can be provided quickly in the event of problems. Available software updates can also be downloaded. To do this, connect the connection named Ethernet to your router or switch. Now establish the DC connections. To connect the Plenticore, please use the pair of SunClix plugs provided. Now install the cover of the terminal compartment and tighten the cable glands. The system is now ready for commissioning. First, connect the battery system using the fuses on the right-hand side of the housing. The system starts the initialization process. You now need to configure your battery system. This can only be done using a smartphone or tablet. Download the B-Connect app from the Play Store or App Store. Connect to the battery's integral access point and launch the app. It will first ask if you want to perform a software update and then guide you through the necessary configuration. Please select Coastal Inverter. Then select the HVS or HVM battery module and the number of modules. Select On Grid and Three Phase and confirm the settings. Then start the Plenticore by activating the AC fuses. Open the Plenticore web server and enter the battery activation code if needed. Configure the battery functionality in the service menu. Finish by moving the DC circuit switch of your Plenticore to the I position. The inverter now launches on the grid and you can use the battery.